Hey guys, it's me. I thought I would do this one as an audio blog because of the fact that the camera is still not working and that's kind of not expected. I mean, last time I did this, it sort of like didn't work for a day and then came back, although it's only done this once before. So myself and Lauren obviously are understandably thinking, Mer, gonna have to get a new camera. And that is what we're working on next. We are gonna get a new camera. Um, but as well as that is the fact that we might get like a stopgap camera in between, like sort of a cheap one, first of all. So like, I'm because I've been looking online, you can get some really cheap and not that bad video cameras. I mean, obviously not as good as uh, the uh, the uh, main Canon one, but they're pretty damn good. Uh, the Canon is uh, pretty dead, I think. Anyway, so that's the plan. Um... What else? Well, today's been mainly about waiting for phone calls, actually, because first of all was the fact that I had my, um, my as you might be aware, my mobile phone thing. I've had the same mobile phone go wrong millions of times. I mean, it just keeps on going wrong, and I've had it replaced four times now, and I'm due for a new model. And, um, oh yeah, I didn't actually point this out. Yes, this episode is being presented along with Microsoft Paint. Watch the pictures come up. Anyway, so as a result, um, I've got an option between two phones. Well, I haven't narrowed it down to two phones because I've gone on websites and I've looked for what are the sensible alternatives because basically the replacement to my phone should be should be able to do all the same things, which means it needs to take a micro SD card, it needs to have a working video camera, it needs to have a 3.5 mil jack plug so I can listen to music, needs to have internet access, you know, these aren't big requirements nowadays, but, you know, these are things that I want, because I paid for that, and, um, if they're going to sell me a phone for 30 quid that doesn't do the things that they claim it's going to do, then, um, it's their fault for selling me it for 30 quid, they can't just then go, oh yeah, that doesn't work like that, and tell me to sod off, I'm like, no, I gave you money for that, you said you could give me that, I'm going to have that, so anyway, I looked through, and the two phones I found that were of the correct quality were the well generally the Nokia C range but I'd say from the C2 upwards of a C2, C3, C4 um, the uh, the other options were Samsung's and uh, for life of me I can't remember it was like the ES2230 or something they have really annoying long names so anyway, um, yeah, that was the other option, and I've looked into both of them, and I'm now waiting for them to receive the phone I've sent back to them so they can send me a new one. And it is really just a case of about waiting. So, um, waiting is what I'm doing, and fingers crossed, sometime very soon, I will uh, be able to tell you about my wonderful new shiny phone arriving, but at the moment that's uh, not going to happen. I'm just waiting for tonight when hopefully I will get a call back. And um, the other thing is myself and Lauren have both been promised to call back today about um, beginning our shifts at Manor Farm Barn. That is, I mean, I've been told I've got the job. Lauren hasn't actually been given the job yet, but um, she will be hopefully given the job. I can't see any reason why not. Um, so as a result, we're both waiting to hear about our first shifts, but no one's called back and it's getting very near to closing time. So, um, oh, wait a second. What's this? Sorry, I had a technical failing there. Um, <laughs> yeah, so anyway, we're, we're hoping that all goes well. And um, yeah, if we, I will talk to you guys um, soon. Very soon. I'm, in fact, I'm going to record a bit more after we hear back from the... Uh, in fact, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to probably get Lauren to actually call them up, call up the pub and ask them about the jobs because uh, it's getting quite close. I mean, I would call them... Uh, probably not the best idea for me to, oh, I'll talk to her about it first but it's probably not the best idea because I've already been given the job she hasn't yet and if I call up on her behalf that looks a bit bad so anyway we're going to arrange that and then um, yes I will talk to you soon bye bye hi hello <laughs> hi everyone um, today's a bit of a weird vlog ow my face Howard's camera is still not um, working. It's still, it's I don't know what's wrong, but it's just not accepting the tape. So 
I don't know if Howard's recorded anything, but yeah, today me and Howard are both accept uh, accepting. Blah. Yeah, today me and Howard are both um, waiting for a call from the pub, and they said they'll call us probably in the afternoon, but it's now half nine at night, so I'm starting to worry a bit. But they should call us before eleven, hopefully. But oh, I haven't done much. Though. I've been asleep all day, which is kind of lazy but I'm just so tired I don't know why I think I'm just stressing out for no reason but yeah considering that I know this annoys my dog extremely I'm going to do it <laughs> kiss ow <laughs> Layla Layla Hey there, just thought I'd check back quickly to say that, yep, yeah, Lauren has got the job, I've got the job, and we will be starting simultaneously on Friday the 23rd. So, um, uh, but we've got to go in and actually see the manager guy before that, so. Uh, it's pretty good news, I'd say. Pretty good news. We've got a job together at the same place. That's, that's pretty awesome. A lot of weight off our shoulders as well so h and will carry on as per normal just cameraless at the moment but nothing will get in the way i'm gonna go to bed in a minute or at least stay up and watch films one of the two <laughs> signing out guys speak to you later